to make sure that we are in the right field we are moving this cursor so it is going to give you the it is going to click in this position in this red color position okay just adjust it according to your requirement you are going to adjust it okay now you want to double click left click right click just select one of the option and if if once if i gave quick test if it is not able to identify yes if you see yesterday we have changed it to 70 because we have identified a smaller image it may sometimes fail sometimes it may fail because there may be some text or anything so it depends upon purely depends upon the system whatever the recognition they are using okay it is going to compare if you you change the match percentage then let's say so anyway we for 100 itself we got and as a best practices i will change it to 90 and tolerance percentage as 5 it is not compulsory that it both should sum up to 100 okay it depends tolerance means it is going to ignore 5 percent as of errors and uh, match percentage if it is 90 percentage then it is going to give so for every it is going to repeat if image whatever the image it is looking if it is does not found for every 300 milliseconds it is going to capture one more image and it is going to compare once after 300 milliseconds it is going to capture one more image like that it will try 10 times even after 10 times also if it does not found that image it is going to throw an error if you want you can increase this limit purely depends upon your uh, application okay if it is not found you are going to increase this and increase this to 500 milliseconds anyway if the, your application is too slow or not able to capture those images you can change these two options uh, as of now we left it by default thing only we didn't change change it okay so first option is you need to change your comparison mode and do your quick test if not you are going to change your mass percentages and do quick test you will get one uh, success message otherwise you need to okay so yeah so the next thing is once after clicking on it you need to pass a keystroke you need to pass a keystroke Sap. user ID. so this is you are going to read it from the configuration file as I said okay just do it twenty-five milliseconds for okay so the next thing is password So since it is a password, you have to check this. Okay. So now the next thing is what is that next window we are getting? Just trying on the general object on the Okay, sir, keep your calendar. Okay, structure follows. I think after I didn't find the final total. Control it. Okay, so we are going to the keystroke itself. Let's save it. 
So, if you want, you can increase this limit actually. So, we, since it is in the configuration file, it is easy to change it. Try two times, three times, or five times. Okay. So, uh, it, it will be the number will be decided based on your observation only. Okay. You will say your observation. If you try 10 times, okay. If it is lagging in the first attempt, well, they're good. If it's failed for the first attempt, uh, in, in 10 runs, it failed in two, three times. Okay, you can change it to two. Okay, even after also one time it is failed, you can change it to three. It purely depends upon your observation, how many times you are running and how many times you are getting. Based on that, you need to change those numbers. Okay, so the next thing is you need to check for the next window. This one. So we will we'll wait one window. So it is check. And one more thing, we haven't even adding those. What if my password is wrong? What if my user ID is wrong? You need to handle. Anyway, we are trying two times. Okay, we are trying two times. There is no any issue for us. If one time, but if you are getting any error message, message box, you need to click on OK. Then you need to try. So definitely, you need to handle those kind of issues also. Usually you won't get, but as I said, okay. Back here, I don't know. Back. 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 Yeah, first screen. Hmm. For sure. Last time that lag me, that creator will put down. Back. Ah, there. Mainly, I can't get that. I need login screen. Okay. Okay, you can use already wrong is the message box and also an observation to the Okay, anyway, you are not getting any message boxes. So you don't have to worry about that. What if I enter password wrong? Oh, anyway, we are not getting it. Otherwise, you need if you want to capture this name or password is incorrect you can say capture this window if possible we'll just try this if possible you can do that operation okay to make sure that yes something is wrong over there you can do that just try object cloning anyway that is not our concern if you want to give that exact output to your okay so you can do this yeah, we can able to do that. So you you are going to capture this repeat log, and you are getting this name. Okay, name or password wrong is in inside name property. So you are going to get HTML get name, get property and name. Okay, item name. Let's see whether we can get it or not. Let's use that object learning and run it. Okay. And if I place a message box, see what we are getting. Nandan or Hari. Hello. Hello, Karthik. Am I clear? Yeah, yeah. Why should okay. Fine. So let's run it. Install application neighbor is a yeah. exe. Install just delete session seven. Okay. So we are getting empty. Think 
item value or name. Let's go for some other thing. Name, sorry. Let's try this. If you want, you can capture this. The whole point is to give exact output. Okay? That is giving us some information. Yes, you are wrong. We just we are trying to capture that and we can show that. Okay? So this is what I got over there when I try to log in. Okay? Like this you will get and you will pass the same as an output. This screen I am getting when I try to log in. As in our, in, in our mail, we can send it. If you, if you want, you can add this to uh, this thing also. Okay? Once after enter, you are going to get that and you can add this. Okay? So, they won't mention all these kind of scenarios. It is your uh, your duty as a developer duty to analyze all the uh, situations and do the, give the proper output. Okay? So, what I said, we need to identify that window if window exist sorry once after logging in where is what is that easy access huh? easy access yes, sir. Easy. isn't it process so easy access SAP easy access and the delay at least it is taking so much time so let's give 30 seconds delay okay so once after this window comes, you need to exit your loop. You need to exit your loop and set a flag as one. Okay? Because this is also one of the bad practices. If you are increasing your loops like this, nested loops, some of the CUE teams are rejecting it because of this nested loops. You need to cut it and you need to continue in the next thing. Okay? Definitely, it purely depends upon their mindset mentality. Best practices are saying that you should not do nested loops. Not more than three or four, you don't go for above that. Yeah, if loops, if are loops, in it, it does to loops conditions. We have in AA only two conditions. Yeah, not close. Just set a flag and start with that flag again. So here if I, let's say what we are going to do, if this window exists, what I will do, I will do my operation in this window. No, I will start doing. I can directly code it over here itself. Again, that window will show some other window. Then again, I will provide one if condition. Or if I made to compare, inside this, I am going to use, you will get some more loops. To cut that, we are going to set one flag. In. So instead of giving if condition, okay, once after this you are going to exit. Before exiting loop, you are to you are going to. So since it is a flag, you need to initialize it to zero. So you that means our bot got succeeded in the first run or second run. So where is it? Variable operation. Okay, you, you are going to do that variable operation into is access to one. Okay, to element this nested loops we did this thing and the next thing is just a flag if next time last one so it's success you know genetic success I have okay success I did in value one of so there was the next operation saying chair and now if window existence check check on the direct guy in local chess each other guy if application running you only in the if window correct if window exist, ikada, if purchase sap exist, okay. So the in tarvata direct ga inko if condition is just coming. Ikada. Edit. If window exist is equals to one. window exist is equals to 1 that means 
here whatever the operation we did for logging in is succeeded. So I am going to do the next actions over here. So we are cutting our nested loops from here and it will, it will we will get it over here. We will come to directly to the here. Okay. Okay. Loop it here. If window exists, we will do the same thing. If we do the same thing, let's say create roles. You are going to click on that. You will get one more window. You are going to identify again that with the foundation again. Malli inko if increase hai. Malli inko if increase hai toh. Alla each and every window ke oka kati increase chahiye kunda man mein ichhe ya lente. Okay. So to do that, ikade nanti kar sechhe si next ikka nuch condition sechhe kunda. Okay. Is again. So yesterday we have seen that our object cloning is able to identify create role of button. So I am going with that. Okay, we can directly click on this. Okay, so here we will try again. We have only one loop. You can increase one more. It's not a problem. But if it is limiting, if it is going behind our control, that means five loops or six loops, it is going to be a problem. Okay, there is no uh, such thing. But they don't want. Because one thing failed and all the things to get those errors exactly, they don't want those. Okay. So if window exists, we will get our role maintenance screen. Okay. And the time is around 15 seconds. Okay. So as I said. Definitely, you need to have comments and logs for each and everything. Just to try to add them because that is the only thing you will, by seeing itself, you can analyze and also the else conditions. Not for all, but definitely in the first screen, if application will be launched itself is failed, so definitely you are going to have else condition and that window, first window. Definitely for these two, you are going to have else conditions here. Here I will give you else. Just paste that code whatever I forward for this. So here we have we are going to have one else, and here also we are going to have one more else. Okay, inside that just copy paste that block. So right now, so if window exists, role maintenance. So for these kind of scenarios also you can add role maintenance window does not exist in the specified time else conditions. Yeah, here easy access. So here it not required so since we are trying many times. Here not required, but here you can add those else condition. Since you are trying only once, and our bot failed to click on it, definitely you need some information. By this you can get it. Okay. Yeah. So role maintenance, and we waited for 10 seconds. So here we need to add our roles. Okay. So here anyway it is not going to identify. Definitely you again the same thing. You need to make sure that you are in the right position. You are going to use your object cloning image recognition. Okay. First thing you are going to do the image recognition in under role maintenance. This is a procedure actually. There is no capture problem. So actual command usage is allowed. This is automatic. If you select a window, you can capture the window. So you can capture the window. So if you capture the window, it is not correct. If you do it automatically, you can capture the window. If you capture the window, इधर नहीं कैप्चर रहे चीज़ इधर नहीं कैप्चर रहे चुप रेंडर नहीं कैप्चर रहे से ऑप्शन होती चेस को वो चुपड़ा इकड़ा दिन पाला प्रोसेस है रेंडर टें नोबो इकड़ा मोइन्डो मतलब सिलेक्ट चाहिए इकड़ा अच्छा है इसी कैप्चर है निकाल से नाइटम कैप्चर है ओके सो इकड़ा जाए इकड़ा जाए दिस इज़ द इम so, we can do it in the direct automatic way. Actually, we can do it in the automation way. We don't have to. 
అది అక్యురేట్ గా కూడా ఉంటుంది సో క్యాప్చర్ అండ్ వి నీడ్ దిస్ హోల్ పార్ట్ దిస్ లెట్స్ టేక్ దిస్ ఓకే యు హావ్ దిస్ అండ్ లెట్స్ డూ సమ్ క్విక్ టెస్ట్ otherwise just increase your image size so, like this just you need to increase your so sorry so here we got our image as i said this is the face to practice is 90 and 5 we have our image so right sorry sorry sorry, sorry. i need to change the cursor position <laughs> yep okay just done okay so now you are going to use keystrokes to enter your roles Okay. same thing again you need to do role maintenance and your roles before that you need to split your roles okay before that you need to split your roles you are going to do this okay let's say ag double one ag double one is your role okay and if i give you enter description target system okay these three yeah, so you are going to click a uh, description provide any if you have any description on i think we don't have right description color on that i forgot actually so anyway if you have description just provide it otherwise leave it i think it's optional let's see and the target system we are going to yeah correct on that let's select dcm okay so you are going to do that so these two values we have in the our input table so you need to follow that you are going to divide it by using comma separated values we have comma separated values we need to split it and once after that if i press enter if it is navigating okay you must to save the role if you get this you are going to click otherwise we have save option, option over no okay so this is one of the option otherwise okay going with enter only i think help us okay okay distribute the okay. target system so you need to click on okay and again so these windows all these windows you need to capture okay let's say this window if you have to do this okay rfc dcm cannot be reached okay whatever it may be the final thing is you need to capture that window just don't go by the process okay it will def definitely depends upon the process and the application okay so how to capture this type of windows whether if you are it's an information window let's see whether we, we if you if you have this window you need to click on yes or no button this is our procedure if you have this either you need to click on this or you need to close this okay we will do two operations in that message box so as i said let's try with if window exist operation so we did something and we got that window so we are going to capture all those windows if window exists so here it is not show, okay information window here it is showing if it is not showing you are going to do this so it is going to give my training so if you are not getting that information window name definitely you need to capture that anyway i got that variable logon button once button two okay so capture this information window if this window exist okay again you are going to give your keystrokes otherwise you need to give your object to any okay since it it will be identified i think it will it will it will identify by using object 
clone so there are so many things we need to consider according to process so okay you can do this otherwise you, can, you are going to do this your objective object property exist instead of equipment of you can do these things okay click like this you need to do before that we have so many things to do so just do it okay okay so let me save it so before that you need to split them so we are we are reading ticket information and that we are saving inside our where is it what is that we sold roles copy and paste it so tomorrow you are going to do this full automation you know now you know the steps right so try this if you have installed sap in system just try this otherwise you need to install even my system also don't have so mohan mission to just now so so don't go by the procedure actually meer kotta ga nerchukunte edana helpful ga untadi ilanti information gaani idi information window ela chestam each and everything same procedure ipude em untanda simple ga divide chestam dan this kali split operation use string operation use chesi if you don't know ah idi kotta command last time use cheyaledu kotta plus plus so you uh, it is going to divide as also string based on one delimiter it is going to divide and we is, we are going to assign it to a list type now okay so you need to create list type variable now str list roles okay and the type is list and the value is l1 Save. Same agent. We need to divide agent. Str list. Agent. Sorry, systems. Right. Sub target system. Systems and the same thing. L two. L two list. Save it. Now you need to divide them. so same thing you are going to follow all the steps and you are going to complete it by tomorrow because i am going to tomorrow i am we are going to do our main task okay so what is that source string is str roles now you know how to do the project so don't go by the process now for now at least you know something so many people who are re in working real time don't know these steps anyway okay so str roles what i want you to try to know more about these commands if you know this procedure if you understood whatever we are doing from the last past two weeks or three weeks just try to know about commands more now because it is going to help you instead of doing the same procedure again and again try to know them first okay analyze them how the commands works how how, how this delimiter each and everything what it is doing in the background each and everything try to analyze these commands str list systems okay now you are going to loop inside it and you are going to add it so first loop when it comes to first loop okay let's cancel this first yes yes sorry slash Okay. Yeah, this is our first window. So if you want to, okay, let me delete this first. We don't have to, I think. So if I directly give one single role, I am not going. So definitely you need to specify your role. So you need to start looping inside your loop, and you need to enter your role first. A G double one. Okay. Yes, Kishto. That's why we have identified that one. Right? Here, over here, image recognize. Click. Otherwise, just change it to here, and okay. This no, one, anyway, we are really not going to get this. I will disable this code. This is not now. Okay. So, amazing. What we are going to do is 
we are going to give our keystrokes. So same thing. Since here also we don't have any operation, so you need to try two three times to make sure that you got the exact you uh, you entered that value. So here again we don't have option to confirm also. If you observe, we don't have any option. We cannot do our get text operation. Whether we have entered that value or not, we don't know. So why, how you will check them? Because we are not going to next window. Yeah, um, once after clicking in this assigning, we are going. Yeah, we have option. You, let's say you don't have option. You have 10 fields now. So how to analyze just by uh, we have this option, right? We are getting if I am not entering anything, OK? And if I am trying to click on this, it is giving me specify a role. If you, and we are able to capture this messages, whatever we are getting. So you are going to capture that once after your keystroke and enter. If you are getting this, that means you have failed. And you can, you need to try. It's purely depends upon the application. Okay. So anyway, I got my click. Now I will cross my keystrokes. Again, same thing. Start loop. Start loop. Huh? Best of practices. Problem is, can you check that? Order, hierarchy. First day you say some other, first option object only failure, lag in a problem with our customer. Justification worry, Palak. You say good than live. Justification on the land. Object only work on a keystroke element, eh? Rejecture, sir. So start loop, exam number of times, and then go your keystrokes. Use your SLP stroke. So I, this needs to be that image click also needs to be inside that role maintenance. And this one is your first value inside your loop. So you need to loop it first. Sorry, sorry, sorry. So this one is going to be inside over here. You are going to click on that. And once after click, you are going to loop inside your list variable now. This is your first list. You need to enter that role. OK? So otherwise, otherwise, because again, we are increasing our loop count. Again, we need to uh, we need to loop inside, inside. So what I suggest you to do your here is just to split them and convert them. If this window exists, you are going to split them and convert into a list. OK, don't click on this thing. So whatever with this code is there. We are going to do it again outside. OK? So how many is? One, two. One, two. So from here. Here I am going to do, and I will delete it from here. So because here we have so many windows coming up in the next. OK? So once after this, you go into set a flag. Again, what is that window? Role maintenance. Into role maintenance window. Interroll role maintenance and send it to zero. Now set it to one again and do the same operation because here after that I am getting so many windows. Once after this, you will, you will get one more window. Once after that, uh, entering target system and role system, I am getting one information window, two, three chain windows. So it is going to be clumsy. So we just need to set one flag. At least it is doing, it is going to till that window and it is doing some operation. I think that's fine. So, interval maintenance to one. Same thing you need to do now the if condition. Here, the first condition is going to be your if condition. Okay, like this. And one. Okay. So, okay. Now we need to loop inside your list variable. My first one is list variable. The next one is you are going to click on it. Once after click, you have to, if you want to create a variable, you can create it or you can directly pass it 
it's not a problem. Since you are looping, it is going to give one value. You can do either way. So if I pass my direct list variable itself, it is fine. Otherwise, assign that list variable to a value type and pass that variable. Okay. So keystroke. Roll maintenance and pass that F2. Sorry, from here. Roll maintenance list type, list type, str list. str list, list to roles. Okay. And as usual, otherwise, if you provide zero, it is going to work as copy paste operation. Okay. Just leave it. Save it. And once after that, enter. Adi, list low ne ani this kunte adi. List low ne ani this kado pete this kado. Put into roles maintain sante equal to one ante. A window work kelly am mano. At least key window work success ayar. Okay, window work success. Key window work kelly. So practically AG eleven enter chair kada. Enter chair si mali single role portal. Single role portal. Adi ka enter ana ik ikar yas na na. Ikar work achha na doorkin split chair sona na. क्रिएट्रोलिंग ओके ఇక మనకు ఆప్షన్ లేదు జనరల్ డిస్ట్ టైప్ వరి చేసుకో మన వాట్లో ఏజ్ లెవెల్ ఉన్నా అయ్యని ఏం లేకపోతే ఇక్కడ 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 ఇది లిస్ట్ టైప్ వేరియబుల్ లిస్ట్ రోల్స్ అని ఇచ్చాం అవును వాట్లో మనం జస్ట్ L1 వాట్లో ఇచ్చాం అని L1 అనేది ఇనిషియలైజేషన్ సో ఆ వాల్యూ ను ఇక్కడ ఎక్స్ట్రాక్ట్ చేస్తున్నా ఇక్కడ టేబుల్ లో ఎక్స్ట్రాక్ట్ చేస్తున్నప్పుడే टेबल इंपोर्ट सो मन एन सारे चालेज मन की वन आफ्जेसोवाली सेम फस्ट एजी वन एंटर तरह सिंगि रोल असैन टोटल नैक्स्ट नाविगे मल्ल अभी क्लोज मल्ल फस्ट रही रोल मेटन विंडो को रावाल अड़कोचन तरह मल्ल सो इला नंबर आफ् लूप रोल असैन टिकट वन टाइम टू टाइम टू टाइम से सो इन कौंट गेट टोटल नंबर ऑफ काउंट है तो इन्हीं सालों लूप आवाल में इन्हीं सालों सेम ऑपरेशन चलता है उन डाली आदि काउंट का है सो आप काउंट के अंदर टिप्पण मानो के सो इट लास्ट नेक्स्ट में इतना आता जैसे कि वो करेक्ट जैसे बिगड़ा आता सेम है क्या सेम वो करेक्ट जैसे हम तो में इतना आता लूप आई हुई ऑटोमेटिक दीन तरह रोल असैन तर सो कौंट कावाले वन आफ दि बेस्ट आपशन एंटे नंबर आफ् रोल तो ये मन नंबर आफ् रोल एन दिन बेस्ट नंबर आफ् रोल फैसे फाइव टाइम्स लूपाली सिक्स टाइम लूपाली सो लूप लूप सो इन कौंटर आर रो रोल कौंटर Rolls count. So anyway, it is going to be zero as an initial value. Let's assume no rolls to assign. So now, if I do variable operation, 
intro account plus one. So it is going to increase. We have listed a variable now. All the strings are converted into list, and it is going to loop, and it will going to give the number of last. And finally, it is going to give you the count. How many rows are there for you? So that much number of times we are going to loop. That will loop. We are we have to start it in the first itself. Here itself, you need to start. So let's eliminate this thing. We don't want this now. Because it's a complicated loop, and we I don't want to try two three times. If I fail, fail. That's it. Okay. Now you need to loop. Number of times is going to be in the count. And roll count. And save it. Right. So it is going to take that first item. It is going to click on that uh, this thing roll maintenance, and it is going to give that keystroke. Now after that, if we are able to identify that control using object cloning, well and good. Otherwise, again you need to go by your image recognition. Ah no, enter. Directly we need to give enter. It will navigate to the next window anyway. So same thing, no possibility. So definitely it will not go to work. So. Your int no no try to clear it okay just taking full window as a client just observation or that you can do it int int video application no by now only this is the way the first box is start out on the road after that you can make identification sap पैन अंत विंडो बेस्ड इतना शापिंग बॉक्स अंत सो पास युवर की स्ट्रोक इन रोल मेटन अंड एंटर ओके ओके सो मोस्टली चूच्चू जस्ट को Okay. Here we need to give our left to click, so I change it to left to click directly. Save it. Now you got that. So again, sorry, line number twelve. Line number twelve. So we have an extra if condition or something else we missed over here. So just check it. Start loop, end loop, end if end if it's sending over here perfectly. So end if end if, end loop, end loop, end if. Okay, okay, okay. This is the one. Sorry. This is okay. So I have only one sub login. I have two left now. Here, loop. 
Okay, yeah, for this one we don't, didn't add it, and if so, add this over here, I think it's fine. Yeah, okay. Now, till now we went over there, but okay, tomorrow we'll continue with the rest of the things. Okay, so that's it, guys. Any questions? Okay, thank you.